How's it going guys? So I had someone on eBay request that I print battery holders for them, um, but they wanted it in yellow. So unfortunately right now we're kind of in the middle of the whole coronavirus thing and it's really hard to find filament. Um, I can't find anything that's decent on Amazon that'll get here fast. Um, it's yellow uh, and 1.75 millimeter filament, which is what's compatible with all five of my printers. So right now I got this heat break you can even see that there you go um, this is called the heat break it goes it's kind of the little throat with the uh, Teflon tube on the inside and this is specifically for three millimeter filament which is actually 2.85 millimeters um, so I'm adapting my a net a8 clone for that and the problem is um, it's so let's see this is an m6 right here threading which goes into the aluminum block and then this part is a larger threading, slightly larger, it's M7 um, metric, which Ace Hardware didn't have any, uh, oh, what are they called, coupling nuts that would fit that. I'm trying to put two of these together so I can have them back to back and have these M6 sides go into the aluminum heat block and then up into the extruder. So I bought this at Ace, it was four bucks, kind of dumb. Um, it's just a spacer and I'm working on threading it right now with my, um, with a tap that I ordered on Amazon. Uh, so trying to make sure it actually fits. And that's what I'm doing to, uh, looks actually good so far, so that's good. Anyway, that's what's going on. Um, sorry, I haven't been doing too much detail in my videos lately, but just want to do a quick update because I haven't for a few days. So thanks for watching the video and make sure you leave a thumbs up and subscribe. And uh, I'll do some more detail about making money with 3D printing soon. So thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.